Minute Maid Park for the Yankees in town. The first of four. Between what a way to get it started here on opening day with Flamel. Yeah, as we know. The Astros. Yiner also hasn't caught Justin Verlander. About to get underway. It is the New York Yankees in town. First pitch for Flamel of the season is a called strike. See, that is a historic baseball. The first pitch of the season. He had it all rubbed up the way he wanted to. And he has a ton <laughs> opening day for the Yankees. Added mostly in that three spot for Eric. What a quartet they have at the top. We're not scoring the amount of runs that they wanted. Guy, but they needed to create some traffic out of those big. With a 1-2 pitch, trying to hold up on it. Just going to show you that check swing. You can make the cut first call of the year. The Yankees, the 2-2 pitch. Just missed the outer. And run scored last year with 90. Bomberbound. Know that the Yankees can be aggressive with the swing and miss. And I get change up right here and swung way out in front of that pitch. On his way back to the dugout. He had a word or two with Aaron Judge. Maybe Bodo. Here's the big acquisition for the Aller deal with the New York Yankees. The San Diego. That is in on Soto. Go back and talk to the guys that are on deck. It's a lot of time. Downward break. I saw this kind of rotation on it, but it was moved. Soto's a guy. A lot of teams in the big leagues. But he's fourth high at Owen, current reigning Cy Young Award winner, Garrett Cole, Queen Soto, and John Carlos Stan. Yeah, we always talk about creed issues for starting pitching. So. Robert already frustrated early with first Yankees plate appearance. This time, Robert. On the ground, just foul. I think the big number for me is across the bottom that Hunter possibly can to give them more opportunities. But when you have these guys be able to produce a little bit more as far as the runs of 62 games played. But well, you're right there. Osoto, who led all of baseball, at, and he does draw his first walk. It is so much. 275, a 275 batting at five RBIs. That's one towards Bregman's left. To throw out two back for one, the turn, and touch. Nestor Cortez is going to be the opening day starter. Open the door for Nestor Cortez to make his first. But here he is starting against, against the Astros where he carries a 7.48 ER. Base in six of the last seven times he has faced Cortez. Three at bats and four walks in his life. That went well above. Now two days signing the. And he goes down on strikes here. One pitch, one swing, one hit, 44 is off to it. You see it, the only thing shocking is this ball didn't go that much farther. 12.3 off the bat, so a lean yet to get things going. In the back, Alvarez and Tucker. Tucker takes a strike. Good spring training is when Joe was spot to move Tucker into the three. He's not going to worry about backing these guys up back to back and bench who can give you some left handed bats, but Joe spot is up. Big swing, a foul tip. It's and he has always hit lefties well. Last year hit, giving him a little trouble though. He just won for eight against this. Tucker played all but five games for the Astros. Oh, and he steals last year. We don't anticipate him stealing. Jordan stays and Tucker fouls one back. Season last year with that ruling in that game in Arizona. Just fell shy last year at 29. That's a walk presented by Art Car IPA. One of the thoughts on a 928 OPS of three. One out. Well, he'll start the season. What? And run against Nestor Cortez. He's oh. down. Reckon he's on the warning track and he makes the count. Off speed. Jose Abreu. Yes, it was his in 28 of his 90 runs. September and the first two is uniform. It's got to be, I don't care, one organization in the major league. And you think about it, he was a super shot to get adjusted to that new role. But you also look. Well, so far, Nestor has not thrown Jose a break. Cortez. There's a strike. It's three and one. Two in. Has struck him out in five of those ten. Down and in with that for Chaz McCormick and a quick visit along with a single. You can't do that here, and you're in, under all kinds of stress right now. Chaz McCormick, 22 home runs. He had a 1,008 open. A lot of fastballs from Nestor early in this game, too. A bad time to kick off your season with 
Yerk was out in full force for 1 0 pitch. Top of the zone strike on the strike zone to hit, not make a mistake. Minimum in this inning for Nestor's next pitch will be. No Chaz can smash middle down and drive it the other. It's the outside edge. We owed it two out situation, and this is a big part often. Up the middle, base hit, two run score. Chaz McC Chaz is out runs for the Houston Astros against him. And with everybody moving on the pitch. Great spring training. Ooh, good. Just 7 7 ERA. He's starting the eight. Back on the move. This one field. Yiner Diaz knocks in a run. It's 3 0. Now you're going to get an everyday dose of that guy. Instead of trying to open up, hit that big three run bomb and really make a. But Nestor Cortez is already over 30 pitches as he takes a strike. He may have left his own as limited at bats, but there you can see three. For Chopper off. Nestor backs up. Gloves it on the mound and his throw in time to get painted. Strikes and Chaz brought it initially. Everybody. That is a dominant pitch. He can create different shots. Carlos Stanton here to start the second inning and delivers a fastball. Two OPS against left hand. Grounded towards paint. Take the play and Stanton is retired. Stack cast. Ball and fastball to right handed hitters. See that two left handed hitters. Anthony Rizzo he had quite a memorable June 23rd a couple of seasons ago in 2022. How to know? Robert does throw him. A I feel like when Rizzo came over, I know he's always been kind of on top of the plate. Robert walks Rizzo on Sundays and enjoy kids run the bases. Presented by a 22-year-old shortstop gets his first at bat. Go to Astros.com/slash Carlos Rodon in that one. Tomorrow, an Apple TV game or Saturday, up and one. So, Fromber had six consecutive pitches out of the zone. Hubbard into center field. So, there's the first hit allowed. Anthony Volpe in a Yankee and Red Sox trade. A fielder. See his numbers against little punt left field. Good jump off second by Rizzo, but Rojas elected to hold him up. But those are really good. in a little bit closer to the grass, so he knew as soon as that ball. So the bases will be loaded. His numbers, or you saw his numbers against Fromber Valve. In towards the grass. No nope. swing. Big lead and double plays induced in 20, the first inning to start this season. Oh. Now he's a what he did. He load him up, get the double play ball, and get out of the inning. Yep. Court could be two. Pena to Altuve. Oh, in time. And the arm of Altuve beats Trevino to end that inning. No score. Bottom half of the second inning. Take into his spring training. His second straight opening to the first pitch of this inning is on the team's last season. Takes this one. Walks and scored run. This ball half. Forget about it. Jake with the rank. Back speed. That pitch was in off the inside corner. I mean, you got to find a place for a guy like that, right? Last year, and has one already. Here's Altuve. Altuve takes a pitch. The Crawford boxer. Altuve pops one up. Gabriel Torres is under. And that's the first. Gets down. He's calm, under controlled, and cleared some space to hit that ball. And that's exactly why. To clear space to go into launch mode. He saw this season. This one, he loops his Cabrera, but Oswaldo runs out of room. Jordan and one home run still led the team swinging strike here the counts one and two One two pitch your field where Aaron judge is there and that's the second out. He could forget everything else just focus on himself focusing on becoming huge will be huge as he continues to uh, Great story if you think back to the shoulder injury in 2021 it has one two to Kyle Tucker Tucker sends this one high Judge of anybody for this because you see all the celebrations there's different it's up there yeah <laughs> oh that was way up there that was very happy for him but that was hype called third strike that'll get the opportunity in center field had a fastball in and Halloween Space City Home Network on the bottom. Signing Josh Hader for five years, naming Yiner. Josh, Uncle Mike, Michael Brantley, how you doing? I'm doing great.
Uh, it's a lot of emotions. It's definitely different, but at the same time. Postseason games, all-star games. So I, I really wasn't nervous, but really? everybody was messed. So there's a little bit of question in there. but uh, Now, Tucker had to be your catcher, right? Uh, that's my girl. So. No, it was great to see you out there with the family. It's outstanding, and I know the answer. But what is the one thing you're going to miss the most? Or do you go out there and compete and win some games? So it's going to miss the banner back and forth and just not being the day. For you, uh, was, did nobody realize how hard you had to do those jackets, by the way? My, uh, my, so my, all my wife. <laughs> <laughs> but now the, the grind of days ago, excuse me, his first inside the park home run. So the big or little moments anymore, I can be there. So I'm very excited about that. No, you sit back and look at the career. Uh oh. That's a yeah. stand. You got to do right No, you're a busy man. Thank you for being on. We no, appreciate you everything you Blue Jays. The night is highlighted by a special pregame ceremony. Here is Alex Bregman up the bottom of the third. We're short on a no one pitch. Volpe takes quick innings as if we have a special guest in the booth. It's a care. But I did not want Michael to leave. Uh, I would think, like I said, we're going to miss him no, you in it. the clubhouse. Other part of his TV radio. Two, one pitch for Dugo comes in a few steps, and that's the second out. Tez, after giving up three runs in the first and a home. Astros on the board with a bases loaded six timeout after taking that strike. 20 season, a little bit better. 86 with a home run. Taz this time flies out to. Here, Justin Verlander, Lance McCullers Jr. Luis. They were going to talk today more about his next steps, whether he needs another. Before we see the future Hall of Famer on the mound for the Astros. For sure, Kendall Graven's not coming back. Yeah, I believe that's kind of the plan. Headline. Then you start, you know, be a little more curious at how Luis Garcia lands back sometime after the All Star <laughs> break. And just went out and got the guy who has the most saves of anybody since. Remember, the Astros are in Abreu was serving a two-game suspension. He has Carlos Stan. The Webster Spanish Dictionary changed Fromber to. And the guy he is just one injured with. Fromber has 40. John Carlo with a one-two count here takes one down the way, two and two, I'm trying to, as he said, it be more athletic. Slowly hit towards third. He might have to test his wheels here. Bregman's going to let it. Or a little dribbling ground ball ends up being a base hit. Pitch. It was a change up. Faded. And even with the way Stanton runs. So now Fromber will deal with Anthony Rizzo with Rizzo on the move. He'll make a play. John Carlo was off of first, but that'll put runners on the corners with one away. To his left. He did take a peek. I think when he saw that Tucker didn't come up firing. Here's Anthony Volpe. Volpe takes one off. He's have three hits. Roberts also walked three. In the By the way, John Carlo got up that lot. That one misses, and it's a four pitch visit from Josh Miller. Now, word from Fubo. A situation in the second. Had a quick eight. The last year hit 220 against the lefties. A little bit low. Hudge and Volpe this inning on four pitches each. There's a strike. Especially with Fromber, he creates so much movement with the tough time anticipating it. That hit against Fromber his first time up, now two for a left. Ground ball. The third double play. Altuve, yes it is. For inning ending double play, how much does it mean to the big left-hander? A little bit more movement and get Verdugo out in front to roll the three double plays. Four minutes <laughs> and two of them with the bases loaded. Yiner Diaz for the list for the league leaders in 2022. He might... That ball. JP's first hit. Verdugo slides and makes a nice stop. JP double. Start making some swing adjustments. You can go out there and get the doubles. This one he had to find. Would have hits from their six, seven, eight, and not. I'm a pain you. And he had to because Verdugo did a good job yeah, playing that low one too. And Jake goes down swinging. That'll be Nestor.
Did a good job starting that turn and kind of accelerated through first base. He's looking for his first hit. Altuve takes the first one first. Jeff Bagwell and Craig Biggio who lead a pop up. That hooks this one foul. Years after that, with the deal he signed with the Astros this offseason. The more games he plays, the better opportunity there is. Swing and a miss. It pretends the Astros lead after four, four nothing. Help from Hunter Brown today. He was he was hyped. <laughs> We're not sure yet if JP's going to go Sunday to wrap up a 5-4-3 in the first, a 6-4-3 in the second, but no run scored. And he has missed on the first. Come across the board. It's walking. Wings a huge thing. That is another walk. It's, you really don't want to let get on base with the free pack. He's had seven three ball counts and five. Cabrera takes one off the plate, one in his career. He walked a half dozen a couple of times. Now he gets Cabrera switched. It's a really good could be the fourth but jp can't quite make the play just to think but jp could not quite get back around he's going to take a little bit of extra effort from the gold one out in the second and the fourth and now he's got first and aces glaber torres he's the bottom Take okay, I'm going to get a four-seam fastball, 3-1, three, 3-1. One, three, you know, three. Oh. This one down and in with the curveball. And the Yankees will load up the bases for the third and the next three. There's a strike. Soto has walked and I think Juan Soto's trying to figure out where Jim. Came in to get a new baseball. Those runners where they're at. In for a hit, one run's going to score. Being held at third is Cabrera, single to right. I'll just run back in on the hands, but he's able to get on top. Drawn a walk. Judge takes one for Judge has had a hit in all seven of his opening day start. Robert getting it. Big swing from Stanton, wanted to do some damage. Got him. He went around. Robert for the first out of the inning. Valdez, who's mixing the pitches nicely for whatever he was. Stanton grounded the short. Tony is and some of these pitches just off the edges. Now ball foul. Now to Giancarlo. Got him! Getting Judge and Stanton with the bases full for the second out. Wicked changeup diving down and away. Rizzo is hit by a pitch. That'll score. Not a bat. Rizzo is big. Rizzo right on top of the plate. You can see it catching that front arm before that left hand. You can see the vibration of the bat as it wraps. Shy of qualifying for a W. Martinez, the new pitcher, facing Anthony Volpe. 35 games last season. Was able to work out that did not let any of them send a 2 0 pitch. That one's a tough situation to start your season. Been hit by pitch and a base is loaded walk, and now we have a one run game on the pitching side. It has been the story of the base on ball. Now an inherited runner to score all of last year. And he's sweet, but also that sweeper coming across the plate 33 against him. 1-1 one, one count, and now the team. And now it is. Brown, Abreu, gloves it on two hops, and that'll do it for the end. Base is loaded, it's 4-3. to three. Base is Nestor Cortez for the, hits it sharply, but on one hop, Anthony Rizzo has it. You're not. By Nestor Cortez as he almost got caught. And Nestor Cortez went into the panic slide. Well, we were talking in between innings. Kind of. Oh, a lot of managers they they understand how hard these win, but I think it was culmination of all, made a very tough decision in his first managerial. Off, which means you would think Montero's going to pitch the sixth. Talked about it all spring. The bridge. The bridge. Who's going to create? Pitch to Tucker and Tucker goes down on strikes. Nestor. Cortez. 
Time to play name that Astro. Power T with the answer. Bregman fouls one just looking for his first hit. He's flied out and grounded out. I'm up. Bregman gets up. Start. Aaron Judge waits. Put the. He bang. Brilliantly boring since 18. Montero. The pin that could prove to be very valuable for Joe Espada. Things off. Trevino started that three run inning last two and one. And the pitcher in right, Kyle moves to his left and puts it along with Joe Espada, which is what we do up in the booth. And I'm sure in a perfect world with Brian Abreu available, he goes up, did not go more than an inning in any spring training outing in Penn. And then Taylor Scott, who's a veteran. But if Montero's able to get through this and finish the inning off, because the matchups are better, and that's the heart of the order. Then you have to find somebody to fill that eighth inning. That's the issue. In his first game with the manager, he might have tied up. Oswaldo Cabrera hits a one two down four nothing to tie this game at four with three left. The Cabrera drops the barrel on it. He's in three of his seven spring trading out with a walk and a run score. And there's a strike. It's one on one. Kind of figured out that Astros lineup to keep this game. Torres. Put it both of those innings didn't score. Ground with the Pena. That'll be out number two. Off as the first 10,000 fans will receive City Connect. So two out. You. The other two run. Swinging. At edge. Trying to get him to chase away. Front towards the left of. Gloves, throws, and beats Soto by to the bottom of the sixth. Your bonus half hour of interviews and analysis of all things that network. Also, a new Astros base is loaded. We'll Starter Nestor Cortez, and now they go to Jonathan Lewis. Chop one into the ground. Volpe waited an extra beat. Knew he had for the first out. As good as the step for two. Chaz with a base is loaded single his first time out. It is last year and the year before. Hater takes over that closer response. I can't imagine when the last time. Oh, <laughs> I think that's still part of the plan. Taz takes one up. Three, two pitches. Power is the catcher Trevino near the Astros. Yiner, a drop. Yiner's now two for three in his first start. So the two hits he's gotten is eight. That's just strength right there, punching it. Nestor Cortez for the last four innings. Passing center field. Yep. The throw goes through. The Astros. A couple of young right-handed hitters do. You've really got to fight to get the hands towards that. Belt. And aggressive managing. Yeah. With hope. He's going to move guys around and take advantage of matchups. But I also like the idea of creating a bat from 2015 till last season. A little tapper. A little wise ago is getting this as he gloves it on one hop. I want to thank you for voting in the poll. Remember, these will come as pitcher here in the seventh. Ryan Pressel for the Astros over the years. 107 2021 with the Astros. It was game two of a doubleheader again. Ground ball foul. How is Ryan Pressley going to be able to handle Josh Hader? Too? This game is humbling as it is, and a lot of credit to Ryan Pressley. One two pitch is hooked into the corner in left field, and Eric his career as he doubles the lead off as he wanted to. Judge take tap. We're not going to be able to advance the runner. Eggman's right there. Judge thought about. And then hit by a pitch. The hit by a pitch came with the left being held as Chaz McCormick gets to the ball. It's an opposite field base hit. He's on base for the third time today. See out in front of that curve. So this is just fighting it off, trying to find that open space. Now Volpe showing bun and has to be alert as well. Now he fouls one back. It's 0-2. <laughs> Didn't offer to. Upstairs with the fastball. Man, those are good. Curveball today is the only thing that hasn't looked exactly sharp. Pretty good take again. Get free MLB TV redeemed now through a straight plate appearance. And Alex Verdugo bats with it with the bases loaded his third time up and grounded out. Big swing, no contact. Just spin that thing like. 
move to his right. Tag not in time. The Yankees. Pitch off the plate. Now held up on a pitch off the plate to such high leverage situations. Late in the game. off. Swing and a miss. Ryan does get through the inning. Yankees as they take their first lead at five to four. An extremely impressive company. Some today as he pitches the sixth and into the seventh. Rounds this one just foul. 100 plus hits and the 20 plus home runs and 50 plus RB. Other guys that are perennial. For, that's all he needed was a little encouragement. Look like the reason he can go out there and get those hits is because he turns these plays into very tough. Astros need to get something going with this part of the order. Astro Alvarez takes a strike. We're on uh, two day can to be the first out of the inning. For AL RBI leader, the reigning leader from and the first pitch home misses the ball. That ball still on the move. He reaches up onto the warning track. Out to through that defense. They've got Aaron just jump on this swing. Bregman swings the first pitch right out of the gate. There has been on base for the Astros as Bregman singles into right field. The lower half, very good power going to that pole side, but right here. So now here is Jose Abreu, a walk of four. One run contest, and Abreu goes down on strike. Still 5 4 Yanks. Makes his Astros debut, Blummer. Johannesburg, South Africa, which makes it that much more you for. Taylor Scott, last year, three big league teams. Triple A affiliate. And he pitched for. He a big game room. A big man. Aerial ball, you talk about Blummer. Pena, but he's still able to make the point. Blummer mentioned Johannesburg is his home. Uh, about a week ago, decided to make the long. And they were able to all be together when he made that opening day roster there. He knew they were going to make this team. He's been competing. For him, what a great story. He spent a couple of years in Japan. You can see the South African flag on his glove. Right here, deep in the heart. Baseball league as well in Japan. As he faces it. And he was just starting his family when they were in Japan. That one's a little down. It's three and one. And he draws another walk. That is the word from Buick GMC. You remember back to a game last year in the Bronx. And mm. That's the bad news. The Yankees. And hit another batter. Eight hits, too. So eight hits. Nine walks. Oh, that has to feel good. Takes through the inning, unscored upon. It's 5 4. The starts last season in 39 games. First battery faces Chaz McCormick. The Astros 2 0 pitch is a strike. I think in the past, he could make himself a very tough out. And he on a check swing, and Chaz strikes out. The starting catcher last year was a 1,001. McCormick Hamilton worked back to a strikeout. Now he's. Off the glove of Rizzo, and Yiner's going to have it to go ahead, or he's the tying base runner here in the eighth. The travel, barreled it up, and skipped it off that lip of the ground. So Yiner with three hits. Jeremy Pena has two. Now he goes out. Twin could be two. A flip it to short. Volpe's turn in play here to end the eighth. We head to the ninth, 5 4. New York top ranked with 10 strikeouts per nine innings. You with a scoreless eight. And a swinging strike. Also has a changeup. Wiry frame kind of throws across the body in his first ass. You are correct. Back into the Astros organization. And if only oh we hadn't gosh. moved this guy. Watching him, but what now is, thankfully. Yeah, Hater. Thirsty, and now he returns to the Astros organization. And he fouls one. Gosh. Got him. Two batters. How to name that Astro powered by Reliant. We gave you three. So now nine walks and a hit batter in this game. And there's a. He did it. Welcome back, Josh Hader. Joe's debut by Josh Hader can kick things open. And that will be the closer. 66 games last pitched. It's only allowed one. Hey. 
Anthony Rizzo is going to deep field. Tubi gets it started here at the bottom of the ninth. Look for Jose Altuve as line drives going the other way. Anthony Rizzo did knock enough dirt off the deck. Standing, broken bat, shattered, and it's going to be gloved by Torres. But that bat completely destroyed by Holmes for the ground ball. Die. It bobbled and a wide throw. Could not make the play on an infield hit. And the Astros make the catch, and if he did, he would have had at least an opportunity to possibly get a couple of base runners on now for your three, four spot in this. With strikeouts and a line out on a great play by wide one and oh three times line to bun being waved around Bond will slide he is to be thought about a challenge as soon as he crossed the no, did, was he given a lane to be able to slide i think they're going to get the blocking call there you can see the lane provide hmm. i'm not sure if there's enough there good get mauricio i haven't seen a definitive tag now ruled safe i think he would have stayed safe there was no blocking on the play after review the call. Clear and convincing evidence to confirm it, which Juan Soto with it. Talk about guys who had hot springs. Short could be the game, and it is a flip to second. As an L. <laughs> this game had a little bit of everything with a 4 0 lead. And created so many opportunities for them to be able to push by Juan Soto to get that out at home plate, but. Make Chào mừng tất cả các bạn đã đến với kênh Astro Giám Thi và bây giờ mình đi ở trên đường Đoạn Văn Trầy à, Và thì mình đi ở quán cà phê Hoàng Nhung thì à, mình thấy ở đây nó có một cái phong cách của trang trí quán cà phê Thế chữ như nửa nhận đại và ở sổ điện Có pha trận đó hay như một số đồ trang trí nè Phần gỗ ha, thì tôi có nói nè Nó có số Thế là điều Trời Thầy đứng đầu mấy đứa sợ sợ Đây là gốc tre Gốc tre người ta làm hình ông lập Cái này là cái cúng gom Cái gom Cái gom Cái gom Cái gom Cái gom Cái gom Yeah. 